New toys. If you can call a seat a toy. I don't think you can. Right. What we have. Um, my seat is broken. So we have to buy a new one. And I found this on eBay. Most silly YouTubers will try and open it with this. Well, it does work actually. But I'm not using that. Because that would be silly. Some of them would even use these. But it's pretty damn dangerous. Even though they are locking blades. So, I'm going to be sensible. I'm using one of these. You get these from uh, like Tesco Sainsbury's and stuff. And you just. Now, I'm not busting these just in case I have to send it back. them off. Yeah. You see, it takes 15 minutes to build this dish, this seat. That don't include the half an hour it takes to get in the box, I think. So that's that one and that one. Marley's neighbour's cat is asleep on the sofa, so I'm not going to never give him a slap with this, which is not good. Now I'll put them over there. That one. And that one. And it, one it. Yeah, safety first, you see. Prefer in black and green, but they don't do these in black and green. They're doing black and white, black, black and red, black and yellow. I think it was. Oh, a book of doom, and there it is. The Corsair T1 race. Okay, now we know how to build it. First of all, let's uh, start getting stuff out and cut the hat. One big piece of chair. Are quite nice. Nice uh, steady piece of kit. Right, we'll pop that there a second and we'll have a look at the rest of the toys. Ah, the base. Nice big steady base. I 
that is bloody heavy, I know that. This is an X-Display one, but I've just noticed all this is broken. That's good already, isn't it? Even though it's an X-Display, I still paid a lot of money for this. So I will be getting in touch with them about that. In fact, where's my phone of plenty? I'll take picture. Razor phone, brilliant. Love it. You see, it's only a little bit of plastic. I don't think it's really important, but it's still, you know. Still annoying. You pay a trillion pounds for a bloody chair. Even though it's an empty display, it's probably broken. Ah, the cushions. I'm not sure as I'm going to be using these. A few reviews I've said it's pretty comfy without them. So, what we got here? I think this will be the seat. Uh, wheels and stuff, will it? Yeah. Pretty much like uh, rollerblade wheels. So, we'll throw these on. against defects. Remove the red cap. Okay. Red cap is removed. And I presume it goes that way, does it? I don't think it does go that way. We'll have a look at the destructions for that. What is this bit? I think this bit is. They go over the sides. So now we can put that back in there. And let's take a look at this one. Ah. I see that this is the uh, handle bit that goes on the uh, bottom of the seat. Box. Looks 
pretty empty. Now we can get five people and move this that way. Because the box is bloody huge. Losing my kex. Stick that there a minute. Let's take a look at what we could have won. So, ah, we've left the uh, bolts in the base. Well, luckily, I've left some bits together. I think that's how what they've done. I think normally you'd have to put them on, I'm not sure. The advantages of buying next display. So an X display, I think I only saved about 15, 20 quid. And for a bit to arrive broken. Could have saved a couple of quid. Yeah, uh, what's it? For about another another week, and got the uh, the new one rather than the brown. So. Frozen wear, that's how that goes. I'm just gonna to be safe, I'm just going to uh gedunk a dunk of these in the uh Schneiden Farkle. And I'm gonna check with the manual. I probably skipped a few steps, but what the heck. Right. Yep. yep, so that bit does go to the back. So that's in the right spot. I've still got my other chair and my computer and I've got to find some way to put. Yeah, my other chair just it drops back. The tilt doesn't hold. So when you sit there sometimes you just flop backwards. Which is not good. That's that and that. That one's tight. Tight. And then that one. Right, what do they reckon is next? So, that goes in there. Are you sure that goes in there? Well, it must do. That just seems a bit. Seems to go a bit far down, that does. But it does say that way. Hmm. 
just seem a bit low. But not back. Here it clearly says the little thingy facing up. Yeah, there's uh, like I say, that's only like an inch off the floor. Very strange. Right, now this says build the chair before putting it on there. But I'm thinking I might build the chair after I put it on there because that shows the whole chair going together as one but with the weight of this thing with the back on I can imagine that being a little bit awkward so if we put that there off. Come on. I think it would make it easier if there were two of you. I think at this bit, this bit's going to be awkward. dinner and the show. I think uh, most of this is just spares then. We shall see. So now that goes there. I, mean, I could take that cover off and just super glue it all back together, but yeah, it's a pain in the backside. them two in. Let's get these two in. That's just a case of sticking that one in there. Oh, I don't know. 
something I've gone wrong here. I am, aren't I? Let me just check that out. No, I haven't. I was testing myself, that's what I was doing. I haven't gone wrong. Them scrolls there, I thought you had to put the screw in and a cap on. But them scrolls that are there, they have... Um, the cap goes in them things. Make sure these are tight. Yep. Yep. And then that goes on there. And when that stops rotating, they go into there. Then you get a little rubber cap on, but of course a logo. Make sure the logo's the right way, or that'll do me a bit. And then that goes on there. And it looks all tritty. That's just uh, that's a bit better. I'll just throw that, don't mind me. And then, obviously that one in there. Well, this is definitely for this one because the other one is short, but that little bit. I'll stick that into there now. sliding everywhere. Right. Yeah, this is awkward. You can't see the bloody hole, so... Oh, I've got it. It's going. And that... Excuse my hair. why this broke. Yeah. It don't look 
too bad. But still, it's going to bug me. I'll get in touch with him and see if I can get another plastic cover. But uh, it's not looking too bad. On one of these. Stick it the right way around, otherwise, yes. Nice embroidery on the back. You can't really see that, can you? <coughs> right. Excuse the camera a second. I'm going to lift it off and bring it over. Yeah, right there, look nice embroidery on the back. The stitching is amazing. Carbon fiber look, even the carbon fiber look in the leather. Yeah, like I say, that. Uh, that's where it was broken. I think it's just when they've got to pull this out, somebody's got a bit heavy handed when they went to pack it. But let's get in it. Oh yeah. Excuse me. Yeah, that's that's comfy. That's mega comfy. Raise the arms a little. That's me catching paws. The arms have got like little uh, handles on the side that lift up and slide forward and backwards. That's actually quite comfy with them. I would say there. But uh, yeah, really comfy chair. Really, really comfy. Um, swivel's nice. Moves on the carpet nice and easy. Definitely uh, easy to move around on a carpet. But at the minute it's sitting a bit low for my computer desk, but from what I can tell at the minute, I'm really impressed with that. Really, really nice chair. Obviously, I'm not going to put the sponges in. I'm going to try it a couple of days without the sponges and stuff. See how it goes. And if the sponges... Put the sponges on and it's comfy. Obviously, I'll bang up another video and let you know. But yeah, it's got the uh, tilt forward and backward. And then there's the lift up and uh, down and then there's the uh, tilt the whole thing tilts back or is it that way yeah you pull it out and it tilts back although I prefer it locked that actually feels nice that and a headrest sometimes when you're gaming you know it's like you get to a bit that's boring, there's always one. Nice headrest. I suppose with the next sponge on that would be quite nice. But like I say, a few days I'm going to try it with that. And uh, we'll see how it goes. And obviously I'm going to flip this up on uh, on YouTube. And also I'm going to put a link to it on eBuyer. So anybody can uh, have a look. How easy it went together. 15 20 minutes or so so let the games begin i'll catch you in the next one